Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Sales Person. This is Rohit and today I'm going to show you Winter 24 record picker component is already available in beta as a part of Winter 24 release and will be generally available in Spring 24. So I will show you the two scenario with the simple one and another one is filter one. So if you want to learn something new, so please watch this video until end. And please like, share, comments, and subscribe the channel for more updates. And also turn on the bell icon for more updates so you never miss any kind of update from my side. So let's get started without any further delay. So first of all, you have to connect with your Salesforce org with the VS Code, and then you have to create one LWC component. So I'm using Windows, so just I can use my shortcut key, Control C P, and create Lightning Web Component name. So you have to enter your component name. So let's say record picker component, something like that. So I'm using this uh, record picker component here and uh, you can see successfully created this component and uh, let me show you the simple one first and then we will see the filter one. So first of all, you have to do one thing. If you are using very simple things, so you can use it directly here. Okay. So in JS, no need worry about to write single line of code right now in simple way and no need to worry about like Apex code as well. So just you have to open your HTML file, XML file and under the HTML file, this HTML file, you have to write your lightning record picker. Okay, so this is new component and you have to use in your org. Okay, so first of all, let me add the card here and uh, let me add this card and that is this one and here this let's say simple record picker something like that okay and let me remove unwanted html from here and here let me add the label and uh, label you can add inside you know this uh, uh, lightning record picker new component so you have to add let's like, say lightning lightning hyphen record hyphen picker something like that okay so once you write this tag here okay and uh, you know very well lwc always work with this kebab case because this case is already uh, salesforce developed this uh, component and we have to use inside this component as a kebab case because this is the parent component right and that is lightning record picker that is child component so we can use this lightning record picker like inside this my record picker component here and after that you have to do one thing here inside this lightning record picker we have lots of attributes so first is let's say label and you have to give the label okay so let's say select a record here let me add select a record something like that okay so once you write your label after that you have to give the placeholder if you need let's say placeholder okay so placeholder you can give any name let's say search and then dot dot okay and also you can add your object api name so let's say object hyphen api hyphen name call to you can add any kind of object name here it's, it might be like custom or you know standard so i'm using standard here let's say contact okay and after that you can add the value if you need otherwise leave it as it is so here so first of all you can add let's say value if you need let's say value and inside this value initial value if you want to give so you can give it otherwise leave it as it is so I, i'm not using like value i'm just using like on change event so under on change event i can handle this like handle contact change okay after that let me save this component here and uh, let me modify this xml make it true is exposed and after that you have to use like target okay target configure something like that so i'm using this one so let me save this and let me deploy this component so once you deploy this simple you know record picker lightning record picker and you can use inside your app page home page record page because i already enable in these all configurations right so once you deployed this code, now let me open my org. So inside this org, just click on this gear icon and add it this space. Because right now I'm using sales application. And under the sales application, we have home tab. So under 
this home tab you can add your component because it's easy to uh, you know handle these all component so once you write your component let me search my component that is record picker com just drag and drop anywhere as you want so i just drag it here and once you drag it just let me save this once you save this just go back here and once you go back you can search any contact name so let me open the contact tab one by one here and let me search the records inside our this you know new component that is record picker lightning record picker so i have lots of contact in my org let's say madison rohit something like that so let me search my name here let's say rohit and once you search rohit you can see uh, two records available for rohit and let me search another record let's say test song so you can search like test if you have so you can see the test song okay okay let me defy this handle change here and in this handle change we have to use like event under this event we can use let's say any record id of the selected you know uh, records so we can use like this and here let me save this event dot detail dot record id okay record id something like that let me save this let me deploy it once you deploy it you will be see this handler and backend code so once you deploy it let me refresh this page here and now let me search the you know contacts so because we already added the contact like object hyphen api hyphen name also we have to add the value if you need like value so we can add this value here let me save this deploy it and let me refresh this page again now search tom here once you select the tom let me show you the uh, output of this one so here in this you know selection once you search any record let's say my name here and here you can see two records so let me select this one and immediately you can see uh, like a selected record id here right also if you need to remove it and finally once you selected you will be see the uh, output right so let me do one thing here let's say rohit once you select it let me clear the console let's say rohit and select this immediately you can see the selected record id okay so this is the for uh, this is for single record if you need like uh, some filtering you can use like uh, account with contact or contact with account we can do it very easy way so once you go here in this here please see i'm just using lightning hyphen record hyphen picker label placeholder object api name on change event and the value and this value is coming from the selected one once we change this uh, you know uh, records or value you will be see this one okay so after that you have to use like some filtering so how to do that filtering very simple and very easy you have to create first of all like matching info okay so let me add like matching it's a matching like matching info first of all you have to write like matching info as a object and once you write like object here you have to write like primary field right and primary field we also have like object type and uh, we have to give like field path and field path which uh, uh, like a field you want to add here let's say name and uh, once you add it i can add like additional field here okay like additional fields so additional field is the array type you can add like multiple at a time right okay so here in this array i can add like multiple records inside this field let's say field path l i can use like title here like title okay once you add it here i can close it this one because a matching info we already have right these things like primary field you have to give like primary field and additional field 
if you want to search like contact with accounts with some name right and also which type of dis uh, information you want to display so you can use like display display info and display info also an object here and under here you have to give uh, like additional field okay let's say additional additional fields and uh, you have to provide which field you want to take here so i want to take in this you know array as a title okay so i can use like title okay like title and after that once you give this uh, display info and uh, additional fields we have like title and after that you can filter out some records so let's say filter contact having accounts start or starting with let's say uh, this name madison okay this name madison so once you write this code let's say this one we can add like filter okay so we 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 have to add like filter under this filter we have to write uh, another code and uh, that is criteria so we have to use criteria so we have to use like criteria criteria and here criteria colon and say like uh, array of object you can give like this okay so once you give this you know criteria we have to use array of object so let me check where it is start from and end here and under here we have to use array of object under here we can use like field path operator and the value okay so here you can see this one and operator we have lots of operator so like equal like contain something like that so i'm using here like okay and value uh, like ma madison and it can be anything in the last like personal wild card character okay so here you can see our component is ready with the filter and once you write this filter you can use the handle handle okay so under this one i will show you these uh, all you know filtering things here so you have to use like this and uh, you we can use like handle handle change or something like that like handle change event and here we can use like event and after that we can add uh, like a uh, anything as we want let's say console dot log and under the console dot log we can use like temp literal template literal and here let's say event dot selected record id okay so once you done it in this uh, javascript code you have to add uh, uh, another you know like card under this card we have to use lightning record picker okay so let me copy this code from here to here okay and paste it here and this is filter filter lightning record picker and this is without filter without filter something like that okay so once you add this one let me check the event handler let me copy it and change this handler here and in the html html you have to add like select a record or something like that like search placeholder api name you can give api name handle change we already use like handle change and the display info or matching info also you have to add this attribute value let me remove this value and here we can use like matching 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 info equal to our info uh, in this binding expression we have to give matching info just this one and after that you have to paste it like this and matching info and uh, make t is t c h i n g matching okay so it's a type mistake so after that you have to use like a display info as well let's say display hyphen info and you have to use display info and finally we can use like filter like filter equal to and that filter we already have this filter and you know display info and matching info in our js file like matching info display info filter 
Okay, once you've done it, just let me save this file. Let me deploy it. And once you deploy this code, now you have to check your, you know, contact with this account. Okay, so let me do that one thing. Just let me refresh it. And let's see. So under the uh, account, let me show you that one. Uh, I have created the account with this name, Medician. And Medician, here you can see like Medician. And also in this contact also we have like uh, Medician Young and Medician S. Right? You can search. Okay. So once you've done it, this uh, like a handle change or something like that. Let me make it like handle change one. Because it's having some mistake. So and also handle change one. Something like that. Start mistake here. Let me save this and let me deploy this component. And once you deploy it, you can see my HTML here and JS here. Right. And let's see in the Excel. Once you refresh this page and let's see the output. So let's see here. So let me refresh this page here. And first of all, let me show you the simple one. Let's say Rohit. Once you search this Rohit, you can see the Rohit and also the record ID in the you know uh, in the end you can see the console like record ID okay also uh, in this area this is you know filtering things like based on the contact we can search the you know account or something like that so we have this you know uh, like uh, let me show you the contact this contact like medicine okay so let me open this record and let me copy this name that is called medicine here and just copy it and search here so here you can see immediately you can see the two contacts with this name like medicine young medicine s because in this contact you know tab or you know object we have two records based this name based on this name right okay fine so now you can see we have two type of you know uh, like name here you can select it and based on this selection you can see the record id here like selected record id and you can perform any operation based on the uh, selection so let me search again this name this is the one name let me remove it we have second one now you can see in the console as well this selected record id here right so this is how you can select you know records based on the requirement and without any you know single line of code of the apex class no need worry about uh, you have to write the you know server side code so you can handle this kind of operation in using lwc with the javascript and html so guys i hope you learned something new in this one if you feel like this is very more informative for us so please like share comments and subscribe the channel and also turn on the bell icon for more updates so you never will miss any kind of update from my side so till then, bye-bye, take care, see ya, thank you for watching guys.